and welcome back to my channel, Melodious, and I am doing a two-week grocery haul for this week. Um, so yeah, I thought I found some good recipes on Pinterest I thought I would try out, and I will be doing videos on them, so hopefully I'll be having two recipe videos coming up in the next couple weeks. So yeah, trying to get back into my channel, my poor channel. <laughs> I just, I don't know, I've, I've had a lot going on, not the most best stuff going on. It's been very uh, stressful. But I want to continue with my channel as much as I can. I'm, I've got like a reborn video I've got to do too. That might be on hold though. I'll definitely do a combo video, but it might be on hold just because I have a room that I'm fixing up, which is I'm going to turn into something that I'll keep them in. So plus a you know family type room, so it's not done yet. I'd like to wait till more But anyway, so here's the grocery haul, and I'll tell you what recipes at the end of the day, at the end of the video I'm thinking of making just to share. All right, so we need a cat litter. Just got some of that. And paper towels. I love the spring prints. They're so cute. And so is my daughter, so I decided to keep getting those in. Toilet paper, that's just Charmin. Standard. That should last us a while because we're only three of us now living here, so it should definitely last a while. And this, I don't know if I should start a tirade on my dog. <laughs> I have had the hardest time trying to find her dog food that she will eat. She, I mean, I had really good dog food. It was like, you know, not cheap dog food. It was the dehydrated, um, dried uh, raw food. Dehydrated raw food, right. But it was all organic, all good ingredients in it, all like no grains, just, you know, meat and other things. And she ate it for a long, long time and she just didn't want it anymore. So I was trying to find her a dog food she'll eat. And I thought I had, but every time I get her something, She'll eat for a few days and doesn't want it, doesn't want it, so I don't know. I'm on to my third dog food. I'm hoping this will be the one, ha ha ha, because <laughs> no, I just kind of hope it will be because I'm tired of trying out dog food on her, but anyway, saw this Pure in One Smart Blend True Instincts grain-free formula because I really would like to still keep it grain-free. It has real beef, this is the first ingredient, no corn, wheat, or soy, and no poultry byproduct or any of the other stuff, so me. Mm. This beef, I thought she'd like it. Plus, I am still getting her this stuff. She seems to like the, the wet food. And I don't know if it's because she doesn't like it mixed. I don't know. But I can't afford to get her just this to eat. Because these are, see how big they aren't? <laughs> They're that big. I'd have to buy her, I ha she'd have to eat four of them a day and I cannot afford that. Because this stuff for just 12 is like um, $10 or something like that. It's just, hi Nova. And my little buddy Nova, you won't be seeing in my videos, you know, in a little bit because she's going to be living, moving in to live with my daughter who moved out. I'm very sad because she's become part of the family, so I'm, I'm truly, truly heartbroken that she's leaving, but we have her till June, so I'm going to enjoy her as much as possible. She's awesome. But I am looking out to get a kitten, so you might see a little kitten in the future, but for now, I'm having Nova, you know, just join in as much as she wants as long as she wants until she'll be moving to her new home. I'm, I am really sad about it, seriously. I'm really attached to that cat. Anywho, moving on. <laughs> boring, boring, I'm sure. Um, so I'm making a, a Caesar salad wraps, chicken Caesar salad wraps. So I need some of these, they're, they're spinach herb wraps. I'm just gonna try to get over here. That's my chinchilla's hay. We kind of adopted her. And let's see, those are her little chewy things she likes to have. And I, ding a ling a ling, sorry about that. I have some hot dog buns and hamburger buns. There we go. <laughs> and let's see, you see the smart, whoop, you can't, there it is. You see the smart food back there? I got two bags, so there, I've got everything back there. Moving on with here. Got some croutons, because we're going to have salads. We like to have salads in the sun, well, around summertime, with fresh veggies and stuff. I want to reach over here because, well, <laughs> I don't know where it went. All right, there was an onion back there or something. No, this is not onion. All right, I got this. This was on clearance, and it's just an Italian loaf. So I'm going to have that with something we're having this past few days. Next few days, I should say. Cashews for my husband's lunch. And yes, I don't know what's wrong with me, but <laughs> I am in, right now I'm in this mood where I want to have these once in a while. So I got a ravioli, a beefaroni. And I got a SpaghettiOs with meatballs. I don't, I don't know. I've just been in the mood for them lately. 
And I decided to get my husband some vitamins just because they're good for him and stuff. So I thought I'd try these. I said, you want gummies? Because I'll tell you, these they make good gummies. So I'm going to try these with him, see if he likes them. And if he does like them, I'll get the bigger container next time. And this is something else also. I take this myself, although they changed it on us. Usually you could just take one a day. Now they they only have this now. And you have to take two a day, and that's Plus, this has lemon flavor. Why? Well, it is fish oil, but still, I don't know about it. I don't know if this is even the same brand, but Walmart got rid of the one I, I was getting and I was happy with, of course. So anyway, I decided to get the big one because um, my husband might want to try this. So it's really nice. It has the fish oil in it and also has vitamin D3 in it too. So it says it's good for all these things. So it's just a one a day, but now you gotta take two of those big, you know, two of these big things instead of one. So I'm not thrilled about that. And I got some black beans and some hot dog relish. I usually buy just straight relish for my hot dogs, but this is hot dog relish. So I don't know. <laughs> Why not? And I got Caesar dressing for my sandwiches. I hope it's good. Two cans of this cheese that I love so very, very much. Rico's. Rico's makes good cheese sauce. It does. And these are on clearance, and I thought I could give these to my daughter so she'd have a spare. Because these things are always broken. You know, earbuds. So I got some earbuds in there on clearance. And then needed some more uh, chocolate bars because I still have some more stuff. So I was out chocolate. And I see, I, I have two, two boxes of those macaroni. And I did pick up some bone broth because I want to start drinking it. And that's the organic bone broth, beef bone broth. I want to try drinking it. It hurts really, really good for you. So, so I would. I've actually just, I've heated it up, you know, when drinking. It's not that terrible. It's just kind of bland, but, you know, I, I've drank worse things, so I can handle that, I suppose. Especially if it's got a lot of good benefits for you. So I got these because I'm going to make an ice cream pie. I used to make these when I was really younger, like, you know, a lot younger. <laughs> Whatever. But I thought I'd make one, because yeah, I could put it in the freezer, we can have it for a snack. So I got the Oreo pie crust, and I got some hot fudge. Then I have the rest of ingredients over there. And so here's the head red box, so I decided to peruse what they had, and decided to get a couple movies. Ah! <laughs> a couple movies for us to watch. This one's Paddington 2, we haven't seen this one yet, so I'm going to watch Paddington 2. And this one's Justice League. I feel like my husband hasn't seen that one yet. I don't think I have, but... I just thought we'd try it out. Justice League is not my favorite at all, but I just thought I'd see what it's like. I don't know. And my toy channel. Yippee! I have some stuff for my toy channel. So this is stuff I haven't tried. Brain Putty. Never dries out. Stretches. Aquatica. Vibrant color. So I thought I would try that on my toy channel along with... They have this huge surprise them all, which I, I have a couple of the smaller ones. I didn't know they had the big ones, so I thought I'd try one. Mama and Baby. So this is will be a nice surprise. And this thing was weird. Doggy Popper. <laughs> Foam shooters. So I just thought, oh, I'll try that. Maybe that'll be funny. This is a weird thing. Silly squeaks. So, ah! <laughs> Obviously, they are going to have more than one series. It's series one. This one is called Whiskers, which... I had, um, I had a cat named Whiskers, so I was like, aww, I sing Latin music. I don't know if he sings Latin, because I don't know, you press it, oh yeah, it's kind of Latin, right? And then you just press it, and he goes, kind of cool, right? <laughs> Can get a little groovy, yeah, why not? So, I thought I'd show that on my toy channel, and... I don't know where they went. Yep, and the only other thing I got was a couple of these tiny surprise emails. So that's all the ones you could get. It's series seven, so I think the last time I bought these, they were series one. So they really, you know, come along. So I did that. Let's see, let's see. Okay, kitty deodorizer, because that is very much needed. Cheese crackers for my husband's lunch. I just picked up another Pringles because they were only like a dollar, so why not? And fruit by the foot, they got rid of the 18 pack. At least they didn't have it, I don't know. So this is only the 12 pack, so my poor daughter. <laughs> and then I got the chewy chocolate chip dips. She likes these things, so I got those. And way back here, is some white rice. 
because I'm getting low. And some trash bags. I didn't want scented ones because I'm going to be storing stuff. So I got some of those and not scented. And way back there is a new bird feeder. Because my bird feeder is metal, but it's it's all rusted out. It's getting bad. And they didn't have at all a good selection of bird feeders at all. They had a cool one that was squirrel proof, but I was worried it just attracts the tiny birds, but I have other birds that show up, so I didn't want to do that. This one's not going to be squirrel proof. I don't know if it's going to last very long, but I thought I'd try it anyway, see if the birds like it. So I'm not getting rid of my metal one yet. I'm just going to put both of them out and see if they can adapt to that one. And moving on, moving on, moving on. I got some sandwich stuff for Sophie Joe's pizza sauce, because we're going to do, um, I prior said that. No, I didn't. We're going to do English muffin pizzas one day. And my daughter's shampoo and conditioner. These two. And this is my husband's conditioner. And this is mine. There's that. And I got some salmon. And two. And two tunas. Oh, I got the reduced sodium again. Oh, well, they work. I don't know why I keep grabbing those. But they work. They're not. You don't notice that much of a difference. And I got some mandarin. An orange gel, little jelly cups, and these are my daughter as well. She likes these. I got two of these peaches and strawberry. Two Chi Chi salsas for many things. I got some soy sauce because I was low, getting low on that. And then I got this for my daughter. Ow! Okay, Nova, let go of my pants. Let go of my pants, Nova. You're, you're gonna rip them. You need a nut. <laughs> you getting impatient? I know I gotta feed you. Anyway, I got her this little floaty. She has one, but in case that one has a hole, I got her another one to have as a spare. She likes the donut one. Big old thing. I got this actually at Dollar Tree. I got the big old thing of pasta sauce to have on hand, I thought. And back here is just my animal's food, the cat's food, plant cans of that turkey dinner, and then four more of those pure ballot for my doggy. Okay, moving on. Lucky Charms. That's what my daughter asked for. So and um, I think the rest of it now is at Dollar Tree. So I'll just, nope, almost. The spaghetti is not, this is, I don't want it. But they have this again, the, this kind. I like this kind. So I got a couple packages, packages of that. So okay, I'm thinking, yeah, I think that's it for that. Now Dollar Tree, I got a few stuff because I'm having a, I'm planning a kids party. So I wanted to, oh, and I got some catnip for my cats. Yay, they make them happy. Okay, so. I'm playing a kids party for for the kids in our congregation. So yeah, so I needed some stuff. So I have some party supplies, but I wanted to make sure I had enough. So I went and got some cups. I counted like 25 kids or so, so it might be a big party. So I just got different colors. And this is not party related, it's just they had these candies. So I got my Knights and Butterfinger. <laughs> this they had. Them. And I got a bunch of crepe paper because I'm wrapping up little surprise things and so I'm giving them out as going home gifts so needed a bunch of crepe paper to wrap them up in so I got blue and orange and red so you know standard standard and I found some invitations so I'm kind of thrilled so because this isn't a birthday party this is just a kids party and I want birthday do not want birthday anything it's hard to find that sometimes when you just want a generic no birthday kids party just a general birth just a general party with no birthday it's hard to find invitations sometimes but they had them just really really cute so i got three of those and then i got some colorful little utensils you know just to spice things up and then one more package of summer related plates so that is it for that plus what else i got extra at dollar tree was the only thing i think i didn't mention was i got this arnold Whatever his last name is, half and half iced tea lemonade. This stuff is good. And they had that, so I grabbed it. All right, so that's it for the grocery pot. I'm going to go over here to do the rest of it. And I did end up getting two rotisserie chickens because one's going to be for just a meal and the other one's for the Caesar um, sandwiches I'm making. I got some frozen green beans for a recipe and some chicken nuggets for our salads and two packages of broccoli to have on hand. Selma pepperoni. And a bunch of different types of cheese for different recipes. I got some shredded parmesan, and I got some pepper jack, and I'll just show you the cheese. I got a Colby and Monterey Jack, and some extra sharp cheddar right there, and some hot dogs. 
All right, moving on. <laughs> so for the ice cream pie, this is the last thing I got. I just got regular old cool, cool Whip. Cool Whip, there you go. And I just got a three flavor ice cream. Vanilla chocolate and strawberry. So I could actually make this right now because <laughs> the ice cream is a little soft. So you do wait till it softens up and you just put, all you do is you just put the ice cream on the bottom and then you put the hot fudge sauce on top of that and then you put the uh, Cool Whip on. I don't know if they make chocolate, when I used to make it years and years ago, they had chocolate Cool Whip, maybe they still do but I couldn't find it. And then you just top it off with the Cool Whip and you put, you put the lid on and then you just put it in the freezer. And it makes a really yummy ice cream pie so it's just very simple. So just for that, it's a simple thing to do. So yeah, so that's what I got. That's why I got that. And I wanted my Lean Cuisine Mac and Cheese and they didn't have it. <laughs> so I ended up getting a bunch of different ones. So I'm going to try the Smart ones. I'm figuring it probably tastes good. I don't know. And then I like this one already. I know I do, but slightly more expensive. I got the Vermont White Cheddar Mac and Cheese. This stuff is really good. But they didn't have the standard, which is what I wanted. They had this instead, so I thought I'd try it. Same price. Broccoli cheddar rotini. I'm sure it's good. I like, I love their stuff. But anyway, turkey for sloppy joes. And I got stew beef. Right there, you can see stew beef. That's for, I'm um, making teriyaki beef that I made a video on on my channel. We haven't had that for like ever. And then this is just, do I have to bore you with this? It's just a package of, there we go. Can I peek and you can see it? <laughs> I just don't want to have to move everything. Oh, come on. There we go. It's the, it's the, I can't see what I'm doing. It's the uh, Harvest Land Chicken Breast. That's all it is, it's a package of that. But it was actually leaking, I've never had a package leak before and it was actually leaking so I pushed the bag it up. But I got that for a recipe and some milk and cottage cheese, oh yeah. And my Faye yogurt and drumsticks for my daughter Mimi. These I gotta put right away in the freezer. They're melting. And even though my friend was so sweet and gave me two dozen eggs, <laughs> which was awesome, I wanted something that didn't have cholesterol or fat in it. So I got egg beaters in its southwestern style. I can make like a scramble for the morning. But I fully intend to use those eggs. It's just I needed a few more. So yeah, that didn't make me feel so guilty very much. I got shredded carrots for salads and carrots to snack on some sour cream because we we're out and there's our butter and my husband's yogurt he didn't need as much as usual and a whole bunch of veggies and yummy stuff for recipes and stuff so i got an orange pepper and a yellow pepper and a green so they're right there and then i got two cucumbers a couple of potatoes that i'll oh, that's not good well there is there's two potatoes and i'm using them to bake so i can have them for baked potatoes some mushrooms for a recipe and da, 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 da. apples from husband's lunch. I wish I would have bought myself some apples. I'll have to do that later. This is not veggies. <laughs> this was on clearance. It was $4.50. I don't know how many are there. 12 chocolate cupcakes. Okay, they look pretty bad because they they moved around the car was coming home. So they're not pretty anymore, but they have edible stickers on them as you can see. Some of them came off. Mm -hmm. But we don't care how they look because they're just going to be eaten. But they're really pretty and they were on clearance so I picked some up for dessert. Some potatoes, I'm going to use these for um, potato salad, which I'm going to use a lot of the eggs for. So potato salad I'm making. I got some, these look like really good zucchinis. So I want those for zoodles or whatever they call them, you know. Noodles for like in place of pasta. I got some bananas. Uh, raspberries, got some fruits or raspberries. And two packages of these strawberries. These look really good. And then I also got my doggy some ice cream because I like to give her treats once in a while. So she likes these once in a while. And I also got some cilantro. Is that what it is? Yeah, cilantro. I like the smell of it. That is for a recipe along with this stuff. Pico de Gallo salsa. So that is for a recipe. I'm, I'm hoping it's good. <laughs> I think it will be. And then just one onion. Okay, now this is what I got. The farm stand that I went to. Oh, this, no, this is actually, I got this at the store, but they got fiddleheads. I'm so excited. I grew up on fiddleheads. Fiddleheads, they're really good, um, just boiled and putting butter and salt and pepper on them. I love them. So I'm going to look forward to having those. I can't wait till the farm stand cares them. I got these at Hannaford, but 
I like it when the farm student gets in. He's a fresher. Okay, so I got three heads of lettuce for salads. Um, I got some pickled beets. They make really good pickled beets. I oh, they had some fresh asparagus. Mm -hmm. I'm going to bake those with some olive oil and Parmesan cheese. It's really good like that. I, bu I bought a bunch of red potatoes for mashed potatoes. And I have a few tomato cup salads. I'm just making sure I... Because I can't see. <laughs> um, and then I bought a bunch of beets, more beets. Um, and summer barbecue. Actually, some of our... I actually eat this. I say I do, but I have to be in the mood for it. I eat, you just peel it. I peel them a little bit. And then you wash them, peel them. And then I just dunk them in powdered sugar. It's really quite good for a snack. And then I think that's it. I said the beets and everything. Uh, and the potatoes. Yep. The only thing is they gave me a free muffin. So I got a nice cute little blueberry muffin. So how nice is that? All right. So that will do it for my shopping trip for these next two weeks. I'm definitely going to have plenty of good things to eat, I think, this time. And recipe ideas. Ooh. Oh, what did I do on my list? Shoot. <laughs> I have my list and I could have listed what, showed you what I was going to make. Actually, I have it here. I could read it off. So, I still have some ravioli left over. So I'm gonna do ravioli and spaghetti. I have a chicken marinade. I think it's teriyaki, so I'm gonna make that one day. And then I found a recipe for garlic, brown sugar garlic chicken in a crock pot. So I'm gonna try that. Um, and I have sloppy joes, two days worth of salads, the teriyaki beef I have on my channel already. I'm going to do that. And then the new recipes I'm going to try is they have a crock pot um, pepper jack chicken. It looked really good. I found it on Pinterest. So I'm, I might do a recipe on that one, a recipe video. So I'll show you guys later if you're interested. Also, I have Caesar chicken, Caesar salad wraps. I probably won't do that one because it's so standard. And then there's another crock pot one. No, this one is not crock pot. I'm sorry. Um, it's salsa fresca chicken. I found that on Pinterest and it doesn't use a crock pot. Just you bake it. So I'm going to try that. That's what the pico de gallo is for in the cilantro. So I'm going to try that as well. <coughs> Excuse me. So that will do it. So thank you all so much for watching. Uh, if you like what you see, you can feel free to subscribe to my channel. I do grocery hauls and recipes, food recipes. I'm going to still keep saying I do crafts because I do have some in mind. I just haven't been up to doing it. And I do do reborns as well. But I've been keeping up mostly with my grocery hauls and my um, recipes. But I will be adding my reborns and adding um, crafts very soon. So if you like that kind of stuff, that's what I focus on, feel free to subscribe. I hope everybody has a wonderful day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.